Hey guys, Daniel here, also known as Dano Films, and today we're going to be uh, going over how to submit a map for Unturned. Uh, so let's just get right into it. So first, what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to go into your Steam, select Unturned, and right-click. Go to Properties, Local Files, and Browse Local Files. That should bring you into this area where you'll be able to see various things like localization, extras, worlds, servers, and for what we're looking for, you will find maps. So you're going to want to go into maps, and you'll see a bunch of maps here. Or, well, in my case, because I have a lot of maps. Um, find the map that you want to submit. So in this case, it's just a little test world I have right here. And <clears throat> what you're going to want to do is you are going to want to take that and, dr and copy it. So copy. Let's just get out of that and then open up a little file. So what you're going to want to do is right click, make a new folder, um, name that folder uh, something like Maps for Unturned is mine. doesn't have to be that though. Just something to remember that it's a map. And open this up and you're going to want to paste it in here. That should put your map in uh, this little file right here and you should be good. Also, I'm just going to tell you guys ahead of time so you can just get that out of the way. You are going to need a picture. In this case, I <laughs> if this is my picture. Um so just like get that out of the way right now. So, you have your map, you have your map put into your file right here and you have your picture. So, now what you're going to want to do is you are going to want to go into Unturned. So, I'll see you guys when I get in. All right, now we are back. So, um, just so you guys know, this is 3.16.4.0, all right? Um, I know that it hasn't changed for a long time, but if in, unless you're, like, from really far in the future, and it's, like, 5.10.9 and a half, um, it might have changed. So, to submit your map, you're going to want to go into Workshop, go into Submit. It is under browse and above editor and you're gonna you're gonna want to name your map so in this case my maps are just gonna be called um, tutorial map so you have your map um, okay <laughs> that's my description um, <clears throat> and don't worry don't, you don't have to take this seriously like I'm not uh, you can get you can change that once the map is actually submitted So now what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to go into your collection path So a lot of people get stuck on this part, but not as many as this part But I'll get on to that a lot of people get stuck on the collection path part will fear not um, I don't know why I did that. I'm sorry What you're gonna want to do is you are gonna want to go in why did I do that? You're gonna want to go into your maps for unturned or, well, that's what mine's called. It doesn't have to be that called that for you. You're going to want to right click, go into properties, and you should see this in location. You're going to want to select that entire thing, control C, uh, then you got that, and control V. You're done. That's it. Uh, <laughs> next is preview image. This part trips up a lot of people. Um, what you're going to want to do on this part is you are going to want to for crap okay so I just put my unturned in windowed mode for the moment because I uh, can't remember how to do this but you're just gonna want to go into your desktop and get on into this this can be in a folder um, it can be in anything just make sure it's empty like it's an empty folder or something I don't know if that affects it too much I haven't done it myself but if y if you are if you're struggling with um, getting this with actually submitting your picture or your image right here, uh, this is it's probably the issue that there's more things in it. So just wherever you are, you could be in your folder or in this case, I'm in my desktop. Right click on it, properties, and you should be brought into here. It's very similar to the maps for unturned thing we just did. So go to location again and take this and control C. You're done there, and now I can put unturned back in full screen mode. Yay. Okay, so now if you're back in full screen mode, <laughs> um, just control V and there you go, but you're not done yet, but wait, there's more. Now what you're going to want to do is you're going to want to do a 
backslash, not a forward slash like this. You're going to want to do a backslash. So you're going to want to do backslash the name of your um, file, so or the name of your image. So in this case, mine is beautiful because um, it's beautiful. Um, and you're going to want to do its actual picture. So um, mine is a JPEG. So in this case, I'm going to do JPG. If yours was like a PNG or something else, you just do PNG. Mine's a JPEG though, so G JPG. Change note, uh, this says doesn't matter too much. Just do like version 1.0 or like just, I, I kind of like it like this, version 1.0 uh, added map or if you want to be like really advanced about it, you could, smart or whatever, <laughs> you could do um, tutorial map or name it what it is. Uh, make sure that it's not in like any of this. It has to be in map. If it's not, your map can be taken down for um, uh, not being put in the right file or the right like section of the workshop. Uh, public, you can make it. I'm just gonna make my in private because uh, I'm just gonna make mine private because you know I can. <laughs> uh, you can make it public or just friends. So that'd be nice. I'm making it private because this map is just a tutorial map. Uh, it'll it can be ready to use, curated. Um, so yeah, mine's just gonna be ready to use, and you should be set. Go through, look at everything, make sure it's right, um, and then create. What? Okay, so unfortunately, uh, my beautiful picture is not going to work, so I just decided to use a screenshot. Some images might not work, I guess, which is kind of dumb, but... So I just did a screenshot for one of my... for a map that I just finished, and I just got a message. Um, uh, so yeah, you're just going to want to go into properties again. It's the same thing, and copy the location, just okay. Mine, in this case, now is a PNG file, so what I'm going to do is... The same exact thing, I'm going to want to do the name, so let's go back into here, look at the name, just screenshot 54. Uh, I don't think that's going to work though, so I'm just going to rename it, R no, rename, it'll be tutor tu tutorial, jeez, it'll just be tutorial. So now we have that, we're just going to do the backslash again, remember it's very important you do a backslash. Um, it is also capital and lowercase sensitive, so you need to be exact with it. So, tutorial and dot .png, because it's a PNG file, no longer a JPEG. So now uh, you just again look through, make sure everything's right, and create. Everything should empty out like this. If it doesn't, then you did something wrong. Um, and it just gave it a minute to load up. We have slower internet here, so it might take a little while. Uh, it shouldn't take too long though. It'll eventually, yeah, there we go. And it'll bring you into here and your map will be published. Again, mine is a uh, private map, so there's no, there's nobody who's going to see it change visibility. Yeah, right now it's hidden. But yeah, uh, that is pretty much it. If your map isn't up, comment below. And if it's a, and if it, I can't explain the problem through comments, I will possibly make another video re-explaining what you did wrong. So other than that, uh, thank you all so much for watching. This video, to be honest, was a lot, was mainly for me because I'm, I forget how to do this all the time. Um, so uh, future Dano, remember to come back here. <laughs> so yeah, that's about it. Thank you all so much for watching. If you liked it, uh, do anything. I don't care. Don't dislike, though, because that would make me cry. And now you're all going to dislike freaking reverse psychology. Um, uh, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.